relationships and when you consummate them forever, you know, marriage, you know, there's, there's ingredients that, that make it perfect. And as, and as perfect as, as it can be. Friendship, first and foremost. Love is a big one, but it, it's not all love. Trust is probably right up there with everything. You guys always have to stay in the present, stay in the moment. That's what you have 100% for sure. We don't know tomorrow. Live in the present, love him, give him, make him your, your number one, and you'll get it in return. Madison, I don't even know where to start. You are the woman I always dreamed of having, and to actually have you and be marrying you today is so surreal. Yes, you denied me for over a year, but it was so worth it. During our first date at Cafe Capri, I knew you were the one, and I knew that I'd be marrying you one day. Every single day, I thank God for putting you in my life, and every single day I love you more and more. I can't wait for this marriage. And I cannot wait for you to be the mother of our children one day. You are the love of my life, and I'll never stop loving you. I love you a billion times word pie. I love you forever and always, Nicholas. Nick, from the very first moment we met, I knew you were placed in my life for a reason. I've been praying for God for a very long time about my future husband, and he knew you were the missing piece to my puzzle. <laughs> Today marks the beginning to our forever journey together as husband and wife. I promise to stand by you, to love you, and to honor you as my husband as long as there is breath in me. Love isn't perfect. It isn't always a fairy tale or storybook. It's messy and hard and takes work. But most importantly, love is when I look into your eyes and wake up to you every morning because you're, we're in this together. You're my best friend, you're my soulmate, and I would choose you without hesitation every time. Years from now, we'll think back to April 10, 2021, with, with babies moving around and living our crazy life. And despite everything, it will be different. The way I feel about you will never change, and that's how much I love you. Here's to forever. Wait, step back and we'll see you. I look the same. <laughs> I look good. I look, you look better though. You look way better. Alright, we can get married. It's fine. Maddie, you're without a doubt one of the absolute sweetest, kind, most genuine people that I've ever had the pleasure of knowing. People say that about a lot of people, but Maddie exemplifies those qualities. She brightens up every room she walks into and every person is, is better for knowing her. 
Nick knew from the moment he met you that you were going to be his person. I'm glad you finally gave him that chance. We're all glad you gave him that chance. It was the first of many steps that led you and Nick to saying your vows here today. What can I say about Nick? So when I started Nutribolt five and a half years ago, years ago, I met Nick. I immediately knew I was not gonna like this guy. He was such a bro. He was too good looking. He has a hard part in his hair. Shorts are always a little too short. And he even used the word bro too much. He's the kind of guy that uses the word bro as a noun, an adjective, and a verb. Then I started hanging out with him and I thought, okay, it can't be that bad. It didn't take me long to figure out how wrong I was about him. Now, don't get me wrong, he's still a bro. But he's the nicest, most genuine bro you'll ever meet. And Nick goes 100% to everything with a passion that few of us can match. You're the only guy I know that plays kickball hard enough to break your shoulder blade. You're the only guy I know that I can hate so many things about you, but love them all at the same time. But most importantly, you're the only guy for Maddie. I now pronounce you husband and wife.